Hello, welcome back to Project Hercules Diaries on day three of the final engine assembly. It's actually day 2.5 because we've only really been here for a couple of hours and it's finished. So the engine is completely assembled, ready to go into the frame. What's missing is the inlet manifold because it's much easier to manhandle without the inlet manifold and it's quite a fragile and unique item. Uh, but everything else is there. So the cylinder head is in place. We've got the cylinder head rings down over the sleeve, no problem. Sparking plugs are in place. There is compression because you cannot turn it by hand anymore. The one-way valve for the breather is in place. I've checked the chain run here. There is enough clear clearance to where the Dynastart is going to go, having looked back at previous videos. Around this side, we've got these two exhaust stubs on. They're not what we're going to use for the final exhaust, but when we fire it up for the first time, that's probably what's going to be fitted to the bike, so it should sound quite uh, loud. The timing cover's on. Um, there's oil in the oilways. The ignition pickup is in place that just needs to be wired and the next thing to do is to wait until the frame comes back and then we can install it into the frame um that's about all i can say about the engine at this point in time so thanks for staying with us uh, so far more updates will definitely follow um and again thanks for watching